Hi, so this is Matt Moran with Career Toolkit TV and the Career Toolkit Podcast. And this is episode 10, I believe. I didn't check online and I forget every single time. I'm in Arizona right now, as evidenced by the Palo Verde trees. So I'm speaking tonight at Gateway Community College for the Southwest Job Network. I'm giving a presentation uh, titled Proactive Career Strategies from Adversity to Action. So that's going to be what we talk about today, and I'm just going to cover a few main points. Here's one of them, and this is just a promise to you, everybody who's watching. I want you to take your hand, put it out here, take your other hand across here and feel. And, and, and the first thing I have to say is if you don't feel a pulse, stop watching the podcast immediately, dial 911, you need some help. But if you do, here's the promise I can make to you. I promise you, and this can be very encouraging, you will have a negative career event sometime in your future. Because that's going to happen to everybody. It could be a layoff, could be a downturn in the economy, could be struggling with a business, it, whatever it is. You're going to have something occur. It could be a health issue, whatever it is. So I want to leave you with three things you need to think about when that comes up. And these are some lessons I'm going to be teaching tonight as well as some other. We'll have some video from that at some point in the next you know, couple days or something. The first one is, the first lesson is uh, you need to find a mentor. You need to find somebody who keeps you accountable to certain action. That's critical. And it's got to be somebody, not a drinking buddy. It can't be the person who's going to be the lowest competent on there. It's got to be somebody who might make you a little bit nervous. Not nervous because they pressure you or nervous just because they, they're not very pleasant, but nervous because you want to please them. You want to achieve what, they set, what goals they set out for you. So that's the first thing. Find somebody who, who stretches you a little bit. The second thing is you need to... Um, uh, let your calendar drive your action. The calendar, I always talk about it as a benevolent dictator because there are going to be times when you go through crisis, you're not going to feel like taking the action you need to take. And if your calendar's filled out ahead of time and you follow that action, that's going to get you through those tougher periods. So that's the second thing. And the last thing is, you ain't that tough. And that's, the lesson for that is, don't be the maverick, go it alone person. You don't have to be. Sorry we have some noise coming by, don't worry about that. We're filming this outside, so I'll just raise my level. Um, uh, don't be the maverick. Don't be go it alone. That's something I'm guilty of all the time. I feel like I need to fix everything. And you got to reach out to your uh, resources around you. Um, and if you don't have any, start to uh, find some. Get associated with some people like the Southwest Job Network, but it's got to be proactive, forward-thinking people. It can't be the woe is us crowd. You have to make sure you keep away from those people and get in front of proactive people that are moving forward in some direction. Don't don't feel like you need to go it alone. So those are three ideas that you need to take with you. Um, there will be more, uh, and hopefully we'll be able to put some video up after this weekend of this event tonight. Thank you very much.